All new at six tonight, pet care has become a priority for many people during the pandemic, but getting immediate care can be difficult right now. To address the backlog, one vet in, Mes in West Michigan is expanding in a major way. Max Goldwasser live in studio to break it down for us. Max? Yeah, guys, it's a phrase we've heard a lot recently during the pandemic. Low supply, high demand, but it's not exactly a phrase that's typically tied to the veterinary industry. But Cedar Animal Hospital thinks it has found a way to handle it by building something that's pretty uncommon here in West Michigan, a 24 hour emergency center. Listen to her throat. For Judith Nada and her husband, Lawrence. This is surgery prep and treatment. Animals are everything. Good girl. They're the co-owners of Cedar Animal Hospital in Cedar Springs. Although not long ago, Lawrence was retired. But that didn't last very long. He just couldn't stand being away from the animals. So he threw on the lab coat and came back into the field. I tried retirement, semi-retirement for a little while. It wasn't me. And um, I think this is my retirement and this is what I want to do. I want to help people as long as I'm capable. But helping people has become a bit harder as of late. His 60 person staff hasn't changed at all, but because of the pandemic, even more people are wanting their pets to be seen. It becomes what's really important and matters to them. And they don't want them to be in pain and they don't want them to be sick and they don't want them to be hurt and they don't want them to die and they want to be taken care of. And he says that has created quite the backlog. I know that many of the emergency clinics around have had 12 to 18 hour waits sometime for uh, urgent emergency care. Um, Generally, when I walk into a shift, I'm usually already about six hours behind. It's a problem many vets are dealing with around the state and around the country, but Nada might have found a solution for his hospital. Breaking ground on a brand new 24 hour emergency center, expanding in size and in capability. So well, there it is. And then we're going to add on the emergency hospital side. This new building will triple their square footage. It'll allow for a more dedicated ICU, a learning center, a library, a lounge area, and of course, around the clock care. The new building is going to be added over here. Yeah. Plus 40 new jobs and 100 new parking spots. And this kind of setup is pretty rare to see. They'll join just two other vets in Grand Rapids that offer 24 hour services, but the only one on the north side of town. He says they get clients coming as far as Ludington, Chicago and the Upper Peninsula, which means this five million dollar expansion is worth every penny. Lawrence admits it's a little scary, but it's also a dream come true. This is what I've devoted my life to and to see this happen is um it feels like an out of body experience that's so exciting and I, it's just almost feels unbelievable. And I'm just so thankful that we get to be part of this. And yeah, some big things are coming and Lauren says the plan is to have that building ready to go by the middle of October. He says filling those 40 opening uh, positions, though, that can be a challenge. So if you'd like to learn more, we got you covered. Just find the story on Fox17online.com. Details are at the bottom of the page. Live in the studio, Max Goldwasser, Fox 17 News.